Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy, Mr. 945, coming back again with the video that I promised y'all. This is my PCC collection for my pistols. Yes, everything 10 inches or less, I'm showing here, all in pistol calibers. So we got 9, we got 45, we got 22, we got 5.7. So I'm going to just go ahead and dive right in, right in with the first one which is a CMMG Banshee, chambered in 45. This is the mid-length, mid roughly about seven and a half, eight inch barrel right there. Got the red dot on there. But yes, this is chambered in 45 ACP. Radio delay blowback, very, very soft shooter. This one actually shoots, le has less recoil than this one, which is a nine millimeter Freedom Ordnance FX9. Yep, you can see I outfitted it with some of the blue components. Um, yes, my Hand stop on there is on backwards, but that's just because the way that the rail is configured, or sorry, the, yeah, the rail is configured on there, so, but yeah, but anyway, definitely love it. It is a good shooter. It is direct, it is blowback though, um, so the recoil impulse on there is a little bit more than it is on the Banshee, but nothing that you can't handle. They both take Glock mags, but this is a nine millimeter. And went with the shorty, another CMMG Banshee. And this again is also a 45, but this is a four and a half inch barrel right there. This is a sweet shooter. For a 45 this small, I wish I had a suppressor because that would be a, this would be a phenomenal, phenomenal setup with a suppressor. And still had to pair it up with the FX9 in nine mil. And this is a, I believe that's a five inch barrel on there with the shroud thing on there that is not a suppressor that's just a barrel shroud on top of that but yeah as you can see i got the slings on those too got the flip up sights at a 45 degree angle on there but yeah fx9 another good shooter too and next up we have the rock i'm sorry the ruger charger in 5.7 this is a 10 inch model. It's not the carbine, but it's the pistol. Yeah, I did put the brace on there, especially after they lifted the brace band, I had to put the brace on there. So this is definitely, definitely a good shoot. Good shoot, good shoot. All right, up top, I have the, what is this? This is a CAA MCK kit or whatever, but I have the shield, uh, MP shield in there, MP shield nine. So, um, I don't know why I decided to go with the nine. I was thinking about really, you know, having a, a small package um, with the thin uh, shield nine, but I do have the extra mag sitting in there as well. Uh, that has an extra plus two, the hive plus, plus two base plate. So instead of eight, I think that's 10 rounds in there. So yeah, so that's kind of like, not necessarily a, it's kind of like a backpack gun, but yeah. And next up, we got my wife's uh, 1522 M&P, 22LR. And we got the PSA ARV. This is a nice little setup here. That curve mag, I like how that curve mag works. Uh, the, those mags are the same as the CZ Scorpion mags. So those can run in the ARV, as well as the AKV. I do not have a sight on that i was intending to start i was starting out thinking well, maybe you know what maybe i'll just keep it stock ak but being that it's a pcc i think i do want a red dot on there so i think i'm gonna get that sig uh romeo red dot but yeah so outside of that that's pretty much about it if you guys have any questions on any of these let me know um but yeah that's pretty much about it so we're gonna keep it short i hope you guys enjoy let me know if you got any questions or comments and I'll see you guys on another one. So with that said, as always, stay safe, keep practicing, and again, I'll see you on another one. Mr. 945, I'm out.